Like and subscribe or else this spider will crawl on you when you're sleeping. Hey, what's up guys and welcome to the channel. Now in today's video, we're taking a look at six YouTubers who cried on camera. Some of these clips are super sad and then some are also tears of joy. So this video can be going back and forth. But you guys, it's going to be an emotional one. You do not want to miss out on any of these, especially one of the final ones. In today's video, you'll be seeing Mr. Beast, Dan TDM, Sunday, and of course, a few more of your favorite YouTubers. And trust me, you do not want to miss out on one of them. So stay tuned. Number six, Sunday. This year is super hard for anyone to talk about, and I genuinely find Sunday to be a super strong person to even be able to bring this up to his audience and put it on social media in general, because this just shows how much he cares about what his audience thinks and to just let his audience know exactly what's going on in his life. He begins to talk about the struggles he's having in his marriage. <sighs> I've been gone, and I, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna try to not make this all depressing. Uh, you know, things, things happen in life, you know, um, I don't want to go into too much detail. You guys know, you guys know my wife, Madeline, she's been in videos. Dude, we've hit a, we've hit a rough spot in our marriage. Um, and it's, it's hundred percent my fault. It's, I, I failed. I failed her. I failed. So. Uh, and I, I don't want you guys to think it was, uh, I, I, it wasn't infidelity. I, I didn't cheat on her. I didn't, you know, do anything like that. I, I just didn't listen. Seti begins to tear up and actually cry in this next clip, as you think he would. He talks about how he's going to be taking a break from YouTube and work on his relationship. And you guys, sadly, they still ended up not working out. Is there any advice that I can give you for the future for... If, for your parents, I know your parents look over your shoulder and listen in on what you guys are watching. If you guys are hearing, if you parents are hearing this right now, if your significant other is saying something, even if they're whispering it, even if they sound like they're composed, listen, they may be screaming for help on the inside. Listen, I swear I would never do this again to you guys because I've done it twice. Guys, I, I gotta, I gotta step back. I gotta. I've been putting a hundred and fifty percent into YouTube. Now, you guys, we have Quebecop, and this here is one of the saddest clips I've ever, I've ever seen. Like in general, I can't even explain to you what would be going through my head if this ended up happening to me. I honestly don't know what I'd even really do. I. I don't think I'd be on social media for a long time. I don't even want to speak on this subject because I don't even really know what I'd say about this topic because it's just, it's just super hard to even think about, but I'll be going and just rolling this clip for you guys and letting you see what he has to say. Guys, so do you have like a minute, please? Yeah, what? what's going on? Well, my, um... What's up? I'm Jordy. Give me a second. So we, well, you know, my dad was in the hospital and stuff. Yeah. And being taken care of. And, um, well, his health was just going down and it's getting worse and stuff. So the doctor said well, he's suffering and, and things like that. So they recommended to, well, to make it easier, um, easier on him. Um... So, well, we just gave the green light to, for him to die, pretty much. Next up, we have Markiplier. And this, honestly, is one of the saddest things ever as well. Seeing Markiplier break down, this is just, it just makes your heart sink. He's such an amazing guy, and it's super hard to, of course, see anyone break down. The way he does here inside of this video, it's, he breaks down hardcore. Genuine anyone who can break down a camera and post it is a very strong person. So of course everyone in this video you guys is very strong and yeah, like I I'm gonna be going and just showing this clip right now. Check it out. What I was gonna say for the six Oh million no, it's okay! Video. Jeez, no, it's okay. I, I didn't want it to be a sad video like I've done before. The entire time I was there I couldn't help but think and how there's only one person in the world that would have wanted to see me there and, and and I couldn't stop thinking about how how proud my dad would have been 
Now we have Dan TDM, and he is just genuinely insanely sad, or he was back then. And he didn't know why, because he is usually like a super happy, energetic person. And during this time, every time he set up the camera and hit record, he just began to break down and cry. And we don't want that for anyone. And so he decided one time to just post and talk about how he's feeling and just get the support of his fans and let everyone know why he hasn't uploaded in a little while. You guys, this isn't right now. This was a while ago. So I don't want you to think that he's feeling this way now. I bet he's feeling great now. He's posted every single day pretty much. So hopefully he continues to be like happy and continues to be the way he is. But you guys, he's so sad about this and he doesn't know what he's like really like sad about and what's going on and it's just something super tough to talk about and just to show your emotions like this and i feel really bad for him and we don't want anything like this to happen to anyone especially not the way he's crying in this video i'll go and share it with you right now we had to we had to say goodbye to peggy we had to her she was never really a, a well dog anyway so so yesterday she was just deteriorating deteriorating really badly and we made the decision to put her to sleep before before it got even worse. She was not in pain, she wasn't uncomfortable, but if we left it any longer then she would eventually be in one of the hardest things I've ever done. As I said, I'm quite a happy person, so... So it's probably the, the saddest I've ever been before. But I know, I know it will get better over time. So I just need to, I just need to take that time to be able for it to get better. And I don't know what video is going to look like over the past few days. So thank you guys. I love you guys. And thank you for understanding. And thank you for, thank you for loving our dog as much as, as we did. See you. Next up, we have Mr. Beast, and he is going and actually buying someone a car. And well, it's something super special to him. And he's going to be buying the car, and then later they end up getting into the car together and just talk about it all and just let everything sink in of literally what just happened. And they end up beginning to cry. Let's see when he buys the car. Car. We have Guava Juice, and he is super emotional about when his family is leaving back home. This will be hard to see anyone you love or care about leaving, and this here was super hard for Guava Juice especially. Hey, boy. Hi vlog. Hi vlog. Today is the day they go home. But we're in Porto's because my parents are addicted to those cheese rolls that we got yesterday. So they're buying 80 cheese rolls to go back home. <laughs> yes, yeah, Dad? Oh, man, this sucks. Now while he's leaving the airport, he breaks down and begins to let out all of his tears. This is super hard to watch because it's a very sad moment. You just never want to leave a loved one behind at all and, and they're going back to their hometown and when he leaves them behind, it's obviously going to be a really tough moment for him and his family as well. You guys, this is such a hard moment. Let me go and roll the clip. I love you guys. I'm crying. <laughs> I'm so sad. Ugh. Oh man, I love my family so much. Ooh. <laughs> Oh man, I can't stop crying. Whew. I'm gonna miss this so much. Oh man. <laughs> <sighs> Alright, I'm back in the car. I'm about to go home. Just said goodbye to my family. I think I cried all my tears out. <laughs> all I have to say now is just to cherish your family as much as you can because the older you get, the less time you'll see them because... You guys, that was six YouTubers who cried on camera. Every single person in this video are all super strong. But you guys, if you enjoyed today's video, make sure you go down below and hit that like button. Also, go down below and tap that subscribe button as well and turn on my notifications so you guys never miss any more of my videos. Also, on the screen right now, you'll probably see in two other videos. If you guys enjoyed this one, I think you'll enjoy those as well. So tap some of the videos on the screen right now and you guys will continue watching some of my other videos. Thank you so much for making the end. You're all absolute legends and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.